What's going on agents? It's Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer and today I wanted to bring you a gear build that you can use for the current global event assault that is ongoing and will end next Tuesday, October 10th. Now since my normal PC is currently undergoing an extensive overhaul and upgrade, I am using my laptop and PS4 for this gear build. So the format that you are used to in my build guide videos is going to be quite a bit different today. Anyway, today I am bringing you my Captain America build, which you probably guessed from the video art, and this build is tons of fun and can be used in solo and group settings while farming for global event tokens or tackling challenge difficulty missions versus the LMB with damage modifiers active. However, the emphasis for this Captain America build will be on solo gameplay, as I have had many requests to showcase a build that can be used in this capacity. Now normally I would run through each piece of gear, but in the interest of time and lacking all of my normal PC tools, I will run down the basics of this build and then show it in action. There are going to be two different versions of this Captain America build based on what level of difficulty missions you are going to attempt, but the basic premise for both is the same. For version 1, which I call Shock and Awe, which I use to great effectiveness for farming for global event tokens on Lexington Event Center on Challenge Difficulty, and it's built around three pieces of defense gear, along with one piece of Nomad, Savage Gloves, and the Ninja Bike Messenger Bag. Very important that you equip Damage to Elite mods on all five of your mods, and mine are Stamina mods with 4% DTE. Since you will receive 750 global event tokens each time you successfully complete Lexington on challenge difficulty, with most runs coming in under 9 minutes, this is a great build for those of you looking to earn GE tokens and purchase assault caches as quickly as possible. Version 2 of this Captain America build, which I called Hardcore, was purpose-built for taking on Russian Consulate challenge difficulty with the crucial assault modifier active. It is once again built around the three-piece defense gear set, along with one piece of Nomad, Barrett's bulletproof chest piece, and Ninja Bike Messenger Bag. The exact same DTE mods are used from version 1, and the Nomad 15% health on kill is essential to staying alive solo while attempting to rush the LMB on this difficulty level. The LMB move very quickly and will constantly attempt to flank you and will even jump over railings to lower floors in order to gain a firing angle on you, so quick efficient routes are needed to limit your exposure. The real featured item for this Captain America build is the weaponry and weapon talents and this must be followed exactly the way that I show you in order to maximize the damage potential. Now you can choose whatever SMG you would like, I chose to craft an MP7, but the weapon talents must be as follows, commanding, determined, and skilled. Now, both determined and skilled will require 4,791 in electronics, so plan accordingly with your gear main stat rolls. Now at this point you can probably see where the focus of this build concept lies, and if you haven't, then let me explain. This Captain America build is of course built around the defense shield, but its focus is quickly building up signature skills that allow me to use my tactical link almost back to back, much like the old Midas was when it was first introduced and bugged. Since I am running these missions solo, I am afforded the opportunity of killing all of the NPCs, which allows my cooldown timers for all of my skills, including my signature skill, to be affected by determined and skilled. As long as I am getting quick kills on NPCs, Determined will proc and cause my signature skill to cool down even faster. If I land the killing blow with a headshot kill, Skilled adds a further 5% signature skill resource gain back to my tactical link. When working correctly, and my aim is on point, I can pop my tactical link, kill all the NPCs in the area, and literally have another tactical link charged up and ready to go by the time my first tac link timer reaches cooldown. And finally, to further enhance the time that I stay up on tactical link, commanding extends the duration of my signature skill by 20% for every kill I get while my tac link is active. So as you can see, the idea is to run into a group of NPCs, pop my tac link, kill them all quickly, hopefully with a headshot kill, and keep my tack link up for as long as possible, which by the way can stay up for quite a while as long as I am getting kills quickly. 
Once my tack link eventually reaches timer's end, the resource gains for all the kills and cooldown timer buffs from Determined and Skilled have already replenished my tactical link and I am ready to rinse and repeat. As you will see from the upcoming video footage, if I am popping my tack link at the proper times, I can use it 5 to 6 times in just one run through of Lexington Event Center on challenge difficulty. For now, I'm going to go ahead and end my commentary portion of this video, but make sure to stick around for video footage of both my Lexington Event Center run through and my solo Russian Consulate challenge difficulty run through on Assault with the crucial modifier active. And as always, if you could take the time to rate the video with a huge thumbs up, it would be greatly appreciated. If you want some more Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer and my division videos in your life, make sure to pound that sub button and click on the box to receive all notifications when I post new content and follow me on Twitter at Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer. At this point, I want to throw a huge shout out and massive thank you to the OG Swag Panda for my beautiful new avatar art for my Twitter ID, and of course, for the video here. Your artistic skills are tremendously impressive, my man. Until my next Division video, remember from my channel, likes, comments, subs are loved. This has been Captain America, I, I mean Lieutenant Buzz Lightbeer, saying peace out. This is about taking the Rikers out at the knees. There's no one who can replace Lorraine Barrett. She's the one who organized the escape to Manhattan. They're holding three of my people there. If you can get them out, Get them out first, but don't jeopardize me. They're going in on your heels. Agent, the hostage is being held on the roof. You need to clear it out.
Negative, Ramos. We've got this. Find a secure position and hunker down. And that's in order, Sergeant. Thanks for that. My people are getting into position to breach the hall. Agent, you're gonna wanna unlock the maintenance access. The building blueprints show a security control room down in the basement. So far, so good. My strike squads are moving in. Reach the main hall on your signal. Agent, we're intercepting LMB radio chatter. It sounds like they picked up the immunologist's message like we did. Sweep the consulate and try to locate him. We'll let you know if we ID any likely hiding spots.
Miles inbound on your position. Agent, I'm not sure exactly what to tell you to look for, but Chernenko will have been working somehow, even through this. So, notes, journals, anything like that, be on the lookout, okay? Accessing network. Establishing uplink. We're pulling down his data. What is this? It's mapped RNA files. I don't know for what, but it's Chernenko's genomic data by the truckload. Agent, I need that. I need all of it. Warning. Countermeasures detected. Establishing. Warning. Network privileges revoked. Where's it gone? Agent, the data stopped. We've been hacked. Agent, whatever did that to you, security system. Security protocols deactivated. Security doors unlocked.
Intercepting transmission. Coyote 1, this is Hornet. Copy. Hornet, this is Coyote 1. We copy. My mainframe alarm was tripped. I'm on my way in. No need, sir. The Russian's locked up in some kind of safe room, but he can't hold out much longer. We have JTF on site, but it's nothing we can't handle. It's not JTF. I'm on my way. Hornet out. You people all need to leave. Jessica Candle from New York. We spoke at Innsbruck after your talk. I know you, and you know my work. Dr. Candle, do you have my notes? Are they safe? Vitaly, it's okay. We're here to help you. Can you open the door? Okay. Okay. Ah! Vitaly, what's going on? That was a breaching charge. Move, agent. Accessing security system. Intercepting your transmission. This is Hornet Boss. I got Jermenko and I pulled his notes off the server before the JTF accessed them. We're ready to extract. Good. How about our friends? They're close. Permission to engage? Granted. Let's see what the second wave is made of.
technology detected. Syncing with shade technology. Database accessed. Establishing uplink. I'm getting the files off that agent's shade tech. This will take days to analyze, but there's something here. Something scary. It's a good thing I've got this. Not that good. We had Chernenko taken out from under our noses. Eh, I've got his notes. I don't need them. At least not yet. Oh, there's so much good data in here. 